While attending Reef Talk in Denver, I came across a Red Sea Reef Wave. At first glance, it looks like another gyre pump, so I wanted to have a closer look at the Reef Wave to understand why there needs to be another gyre pump on the market. First up, some technical info. The Reef Wave comes in two sizes, the Reef Wave 45 and the Reef Wave 25. The 45 pushes 3,960 gallons per hour, and the 25 pushes 1,960 gallons per hour. Now, given that most of my builds are larger tanks, I would like to see a large version that pushes more than 5,000 gallons per hour. For most of you, the 45 and the 25 are gonna work just fine. One part about gyre pumps that always bothered me was how tedious the servicing of the pumps were. And I'm glad to report that both models have the new and much improved bearings. These bearings make the pumps very easy to service. Just pull out the cover, remove the paddle, then the bearings are readily available for cleaning or replacing. The bearings are also color coded for right or left sides, making the replacement that much easier. Now the part where the reef wave really differs and the part that makes a reef wave my gyre pump of choice, the controller. The controller is very easy to use. The dial in the center is used for speed adjustments and directional, that's forward or backward adjustments. The mode button over here lets you change pump modes. Simply hold the button and then press the button again to change modes. That's it. Very straightforward and much easier than other dryer pump controllers which are clunky, confusing, and frustrating. I also like the status light on the dial which lets you see the current intensity of the reef wave with a quick glance. For those of you wanting more tech out of the Reef Wave, the Reef Beat app lets you control the Reef Wave via your smartphone or tablet over your Wi Fi connection. Setting up the app was straightforward and easy. Once inside the app, you can choose a pre designed program or create your own program. Now, what you're seeing here is me creating a custom program on the fly. It's very simple. I suspect the ReefBeat app will continue to expand to control unannounced devices as it now controls a respec light and the ReefWave pump. And there is push button notification functionality built into the app, so something has to be going on behind the scenes. The ReefWave is a big improvement over other gyre pumps on the market, and I've finally found a gyre pump that I'm happy with. Thank goodness.